Hey guys, hey everyone, how y'all doing? Good morning, good evening, good afternoon, good night, good twilight, good whatever it is where you are. It's your girl Twin D and thank you so so much for stopping by the channel. To all my subscribers, big up on yourself. Thank you for the support. Thank you so so much guys for all of those of you who support me and this channel. I love you guys and again, thank you, thank you, thank you. Let's jump straight into your message and let's see why there's no communication between you and your divine masculine or divine feminine if you are here masculines. All right. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come. Thine will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power and the glory forever and ever amen all right let's see what's going on why is there no communication father god between these masculines and feminines what's the situation what's up here why is there no communication please no communication thursday so let's figure everything out <laughs> you have the five of swords and the seven of pentacles whoever this is they're pending 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 thinking 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 okay Okay, this is what I'm going to do. This is what I want to do. This is what I'm going to do. But at the same time, no action. No action. So, them not talking to you is because what they're doing is actually planning to make a move. Is actually planning for something to move from one level to the next here. But whoever this is, it's like they have this nervous energy. They have this nervous energy. This person is planning a return, but they are nervous. Look what's on the bottom, the Knight of Cups. So they are planning a return here, or they're planning on saying something, showing some sort of feelings towards you. But, but, yeah, that nervous energy. What else can you tell me is going on? King of Swords, right. I just told you. They're trying to make that decision. They're trying to make that decision. It's like they're on this back and forth energy. It's like, okay, I'm going to call them today. When today comes. Oh, no, 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 it's okay. Tomorrow, tomorrow, tomorrow. <laughs> tomorrow, 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 tomorrow. This person is looking at everything that happened between you and them. And everything that they see or that they were reminiscing on is pure positivity. All positivity. So right now, it's like they know that even if it takes them a little while to move forward, whatever it is they're going to receive when they come towards you, it's prosperous. So it's, like, it's not like they're worried that, that they're going to get hurt if they come, that's why they're holding back. No, this divine masculines or feminine, whoever. What they are seeing, what they are feeling, they know it will be positive. So they are making up their minds. What else can you tell me that's going on? Why is there no communication? The, the, the wheel of fortune. Aye. Here comes the bad news. <laughs> oh my God. Here comes the bad news. The wheel of fortune in the reverse. So something is not going like it should. Something is not happening like it should in your masculine's life. And this is what's keeping them stuck. This is what's... I don't know what I feel. It's like... Uh, just stuck. Just stuck. Like everything is out of control for your divine masculines. They are dealing with a lot of stress here. For some, it's because they're not showing the way that they truly feel. That's what's stopping the communication. So it's like, if they should just come forward and say what they feel, things will start to flow the way it should. But something is not right. Something is not right. Give me, give, Father God, give me something on this Wheel of Fortune. Why it's in the reverse? What's not right? What's What's... What is this that's keeping the communication from coming in? What is this? Somebody's blocked. 
somebody's blocked from their happiness and the reason again is because they're blocking off their heart here they're protecting their emotions so so it's a fear again it's fear so it's like this person is like purposefully blocking their blessing purposefully blocking their blessing and it's because of a broken heart. It's because of a broken heart. Ten of Wands. They're carrying a burden. They're carrying a burden. And this burden has to do with their poor little hearts. Oh my God. When, when, when... The masculines get their hearts broken. It's harder for them to deal with than when we as feminines get our hearts broken. And that the reason is because the Divine Feminine knows what compassion is. The Divine Feminine knows what love is. The Divine Feminine is the compassionate one. The Divine Masculine, they, they don't have compassion. They don't have a lot of feelings. They don't execute feelings that's that's our job feminine we're the comforters we are the the, the soft ones the pillow ones the, the ones that how, how do I put it nourish the ones that cure the ones that heal the ones that love and the masculines are just the workers and the fighters and making sure everything is in order to make sure that my empress is, is okay, my family is okay. So when they get their hearts broken, they don't know what to do with their emotions. Because masculines, they don't have the emotions. That's why now they have to learn to express their emotions. So these masculines here, when they, get, when they got their heart broken, they didn't know how to handle it and it has been a burden on them for however long they've been carrying around this burden of heartache they are seeing something positive something that can last for a lifetime with you but they are their own blockage they are their own blockage Mm, blocking their destiny, their own destiny, my God. Ah, pain, pain. Pain is hard for anyone to deal with. And if you don't have the sympathy for others, then how can you love them? That's why we got to learn to put ourselves in their shoe. That's what real love is, understanding somebody where they're coming from. Even though you're, especially when you are going through the same thing or when you have gone through the same thing, then you understand what somebody is going through and you can have more compassion on them. Give me one more here as to why there is no communication with these divine masculines, please. 828. Ah, there you go. <laughs> the Knight of Cups. So there may be an offer coming in for some of you for some of you who have not been having any form of communication for a while something's gonna happen that wheel is gonna start to turn and there's gonna be some sort of offer that's coming in it doesn't have to be any massive big old offer but but it's something that's gonna make you feel good right it's something that's that's gonna balance the scales it's something that's going to change the way that your connection was going, the direction that your connection was going. The Queen of Cups. This person has a lot of love for you, but they're keeping it buried. They're keeping it buried. They're keeping it buried. As a matter of fact, them coming towards you, they're, they're, they're keeping it a secret as well. They're keeping it a secret. What else can you tell me that's happening around your divine, around these divine masculine Father God, why there's no communication, please? What else is happening around them, please? A hand of card. A hand of, <laughs> a hand of card. <laughs> like I said, they're not showing. They're not telling. 
what they're doing, they're doing in secret. So sometimes you're not hearing from them, whatever they're doing, they're making plans, but they're doing it in secret. You have not enough. So some of your divine masculines are, are facing um, separations and divorces here. Insecurities as well. And you also have um, self-sabotage here. So the energy is still coming out where these divine masculines, whoever they were here, that were blocking their own blessings. Blocking their own blessings. Some of these divine masculines, they may see some of you guys like like you're you're moving to the next level with somebody else or not even with somebody else like 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 you're like you're releasing them and you're planning on moving forward they feel this energy some they may see you on social media and there's some sort of a jealous energy here as well you have the chaser the chaser in a codependent relationship so some of your divine masculines are in codependent relationships where they are the chaser where they are the chaser because they're fearing abandonment that's the insecurity issue there. That's the insecurity issue. See what I'm saying? Meeting someone new. Meeting someone new. So some of your divine masculines, they are keeping an eye on you. And they see some sort of action that's happening between you two. And this is also keeping them um, fr from, coming, from coming around. This relationship is over. Oh my good God. No second chance. Your divine masculines are breaking free from these corrupted relationships that they were in. Like I was saying, some of them, they're breaking free. They're, they're in separation. They're going through divorces. Some of your divine masculines may feel like it's over between you and them. So it's, oh my gosh. The block, the block that they have. Addictions, codependency, obsession. Trying to be controlling, want to control every single thing. Because they have insecurities. So they have to get over all of these before they can move forward. What's their advice, please, Father God? What's your advice for whoever it is that's watching in regards to this message? What's your advice, please? Take back your power. Archangel Raziel, use your God-given power and intention to manifest blessings in your life. So take back your power. Use that God-given gift that God gave to you to manifest. You have the power to manifest. And if you want this communication, you can manifest that. But at the same time, manifesting is not only trying to manifest, but you have to prepare the space for communication. So you can manifest this communication, but if the environment is not suitable for calm and collective communication between you and somebody, even if they come, they're going to go again. They're going to go again. So prepare the area as well. Breathe, Archangel Raphael. Take several deep breaths and exhale slowly to awaken your energy and to release old patterns. This is your advice. Encourage, Archangel Ariel. Be courageous and stand up for your beliefs. So some of us here, we really need to be fighting for what we believe in. You believe in this connection. You believe in the person. You believe that this person is the one for you. If you want it, you got to fight for it. If you want it, you got to fight for it. And I don't mean you go fight somebody out there for it. You got to do the work on yourself. You got to do the work on yourself so you can mirror the, on them. And they will put in that work. You have brilliant idea, Archangel Uriel. Yes, your idea is divinely guided. Please take action to bring your idea to fruition. So some of you guys have been getting these ideas, things popping up in your head. What you need to do, things you need to say. Like you may even be getting this this urge to contact your person or the urge to start something new, move somewhere, whatever it is. It's guidance. Listen to it. If you know it will help you, it's a good advice. And if you don't know, if it's something you really need to do, ask God. Ask God about it. Take care. Love you all. Let go let God to purchase your book or a reading. Go to twindyflamedy.square.site for all your precious stone bracelets. Go to twindyholisticboutique.square.site and your bath and body products, your lip balms, your lip glosses, your bath bombs as well, body butters.
go to Diane's Bath and Body that square that site. Check the description box below, guys, and the new website is there as well. TDHB.club. So you can make all those purchases I just mentioned in one. Okay? Love you. Let go and let God. Follow me over there on TikTok, guys. Help me get to a thousand um, followers so I can start to do lives over there. I so want to do lives. I want to do lives. I want to do lives, please. <laughs> All right, love you later, and I'll see you at the questions and answer later. I'm going to set that live, and I'm put it on here so you can set your reminder so you don't miss it. All right, let go and let God hit that subscription button, thumbs up the video, support your girl, and now the thanks button is somewhere underneath the video. I think it's after it premieres where you can send a donation if you watch the message afterwards and you didn't get to... Um, send any in the um what they call it in the premiere when the video went, went live you can do it after so that's what the thanks button is for if you appreciate what i do here if you want to say thank you a dollar i don't care thank you thank you very much because i didn't give you anything to put down you know so a dollar i don't care thank you love you like one like god and i'll see you at your question and answer messages and don't forget i will also be pulling some um cards for you as well to see what's going on with your person why there's no communication later guys let go and let god love you